Should I buy or sell Exila? The report for Exila was first published on our website Wednesday, January 25, 2023, but this is a more detailed version. Subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Since November 15, 2022, our system ranks Exila as a cell candidate, giving it a score of minus 4.851. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 73.17%. This is an average return of minus 1.52% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Exila our last headline reads, Big movements in Exila stock price on Wednesday moving 11.53% between high and low. The Exila stock price fell by minus 6.17% on the last day, Wednesday, January 25, 2023, from $0.0794 to $0.0745. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 11.53% from a day low at $0.0720 to a day high of $0.0803. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a minus 7.91% loss for the last two weeks. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 107 million shares and in total, 247 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $18.38 million. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $19.11, and the lowest price was $0.0700. Right now the price is 99.61%, or $19.04, below 52-week high and 99.93%, or $108.93, below all-time high July 13, 2021 where the price hit $109. The stock lies in the lower of a very wide and falling trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at $0.0328 is broken, it will firstly indicate a stronger fall rate. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 44.25% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 75.46% and 99.76%. The 12-month trended indicates a minus 99.84% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 100% and minus 105.07%. This equals a price between $0 and $0.0038 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets on Thursday, August 18, 2022 B, Riley Securities set price target to 2. On Thursday, March 24, 2022 Cantor Fitzgerald set price target to 2. On Wednesday, March 23, 2022 B, Riley Securities set price target to 0.55. On Tuesday, August 31, 2021 B, Riley Securities set price target to 4. On Wednesday, June 2, 2021 Cantor Fitzgerald set price target to 4. From analysts Exila stock received a general neutral rating. The analysts give P-E ratio a strong sell and price to book a strong sell rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the stock and sell rating. The following signals have been found for Exila. There are mixed signals in the stock today. The Exila stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $0.0790 and $0.0968. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. 
A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Monday, January 9, 2023, and so far it has risen 4.93%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, buy signal 12 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 405 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal 50 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Holds a sell signal. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 127 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Holds a sell signal. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Exila Exila finds support from accumulated volume at $0.0744 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock may move much during the day, volatility, and with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.0083 between high and low, or 11.53%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 12.43%. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Exila. The price to earnings ratio, PE ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Exila currently has a price earning ratio of minus 0.0031. A negative high price to earnings ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even the most established companies experience down periods, which may be due to environmental factors that are out of the company's control. However, companies that consistently show a negative price to earnings ratio are not generating sufficient profit and run the risk of bankruptcy. Next upcoming earnings report for Q4 2022 is expect to be released March 10, 2023. The consensus among the analysts are dash dollar 0.250. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Exila meets first resistance at $0.0794. If you do not hold Exila shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Exila finds first level of support at $0.0744 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Exila is neutral. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On August 16, 2022 Clark Coley made an inside sell of 6,250 of restricted stock units. On August 16, 2022 Bilance and Mark A made an inside sell of 6,250 of restricted stock units. On August 16, 2022 Aikens Martin P. made an inside sell of 6,250 of restricted stock units. On August 16, 2022 Chudda Par made an inside sell of 7,954 of restricted stock units. On July 21, 2022 Chudda Par made an inside buy of 70921 of common stock, par value $0.0001 per share, common stock. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 44.885. In total, the insiders bought 3,796,610 and sold 14,395,472 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is Exila stock a buy? Exila holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. 
For the trading on Thursday 26th we expect Exila to open up $0.0011 and start trading at $0.0756. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to 